Oh yeah, look at that beautiful chart. Oh my god. Oh, that's like a big ass dick. Look at that. Beautiful. Well, let's have a look at what's going on with crypto mines. <laughs> the token that was once $750 and now it's at 3. But hey, it was also uh, $1 even less anyway so uh, if we go over to the telegram we see that they say uh, hello everyone in the last three days we tried to stop the FUD blah 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 nothing we did did anything so what did we do or uh, we made a medium article and uh, there's gonna be a voting so they posted this at uh, 22 minutes and now it's 28 that's six minutes ago I'm fucking early I'm gonna be the first youtuber to post this shit I'm gonna get all the fucking views bro I'm gonna be famous I'm gonna smoke all the crack that I have in my house. I was gonna do that anyway, but I'm, a, you know, now maybe there's a. Let, let's get into the medium article. So, Crypto Mines Community Voting. Before I read all this shit, I haven't read it yet, so it's gonna be my first time. Let me see if I am recording. I am. Beautiful. Alright, let's just get right into it. Crypto Mines Community Voting. Crypto Mines was born from the dreams of Delvers to do a better. Blah, blah, blah. P turn. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we have the thing. Snowball effect, right? In this way, we could observe how it would uh, huh, devastating fall as the big massive growth of crypto mines will people confidence was totally eroded when the price of token took a hit. That uh, yeah, 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 huh? The same reinvestment effect is necessary in order to continue with a healthy and collaborative environment of play to earn games. Yeah, huh? Crypto mines at its peak managed to make a refill its rewards pool. Yeah, one two one point two million mints per day. After all, we started to see numbers. Yeah, huh? The crypto mines universe has been terribly affected in the last days by space colossi what was that then we'll go across them. first of all we continue with the current pace then we'll be uh -huh, uh, therefore we propose a complete interdimensional transportation of the crypto mines universe to another part of our metaverse where discount tickets for mints which can be exchanged in the market will be given to all current crypto mines players and everyone will be able to do their part to achieve much more stable game with all the improvements so basically they changing up the game we propose to launch a game with different mechan mechanics to mitigate external manip manipulation of the token, Oracle directly at the time of the claim, a circulating economy that allows constant reinvestment, and NFTs that degrade over time, allowing greater longer longevity of the project. There will be no pre-sale or private sale for the new token, so we're going to have a new token, as having played crypto miles will give an initial discount entry to our new metaverse. In addition, the initial liquidity will be provided by the developers. We will also offer you a 3D world where you can descend to explore each planet and collect resources. These worlds allow you to immerse yourself in the universe of Crypto Mines Reborn and manage your characters in a third person camera. What? This will allow us to add multiple new features, not only visual, for example, skins, gameplay, mechanics. What? It's gonna be third person? Like fucking GTA? <laughs> Crypto Mines GTA? Uh, migration mechanics from crypto mines the legacy will be to mitigate the crypto mines reborn the following you will be able to convert your fleets into discount tickets for mints from crypto mines depending on your rank and amount of mining power you will be given a number of discount tickets right the cost of mint in crypto mines will be different than crypto mines <laughs> mints will be available for three weeks once the mint is disabled a breeding system will be implemented in order to obtain new NFTs. right so minting only for three weeks unlike now in the game where you could just keep minting like an animal and then you gotta breed which is kind of interesting and i think adds more value to the nfts that you do have your nfts will have more features besides mining power the contract of nfts will scale corresponding to the mine power of the fleet the initial currency of crypto mines will be dark matter which will have a constant in-game value of one to one with the usdt okay so it's a stable coin and can be used for all in-game transactions including the market upon claiming your dark matter our token will be issued with oracle system five percent of the rewards in our new token will be delivered directly to your wallet after each expedition what? can be claimed every 15 days you will have a constant burning of nfts for repair and maintenance of your fleets there will also be a mini game with the, this 3d world where you can use your tokens time folder of the new project five days for the initial phase, all functions for the 3D world, the breeding system and minigames, two weeks for the beta test of our 3D functionality. So in five days and another two weeks, 1% tax on all token purchases and 2% on all sales. These taxes for all will go back into the reward pool. Token supply, 5 million again, but it's gonna stay stable at $1? What? Or is this, what? 
market income and listing on yeah 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 reward pool 40 percent liquidity pool 50 percent all fees collected during the first week will be used to add liquidity okay if this vote is approved will continue to function normally until the reward pool reaches a critical state so the game the actual crypto mines game is still gonna be going as in if you have a fleet of one and a half thousand let's say like i do you can still make a hundred dollars a day depending on how, what the price of it is okay i i think that's what they're saying if not approved will continue to function no matter as world police is zero but it's no longer possible to continue payments why work and restart the game the only way to ensure the long-term sustainability of compliance during entire rework achieving an economy from zero with the global nfts that need constant reinvestment this way an nft is created will not continue to cause negative effects uh-huh starting from zero also avoids the current inflation that exists in crypto mines it will be possible to mitigate an extra huh? well, the discount for crypto and players be the vote by having an initial investment from the dilpers this will correspond directly to discounts given for the players entry from right they will be given exchangeable tickets in the marketplace which can be used to obtain discounts but only discounts so you still have to put money in where will developers, huh? developers yeah there will be pre-sale no there won't be why do all of this why is the crypto mines themes uh, yeah 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 blah 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 final measures the 642,000 ethereum are currently unlocked will be added to the crypto mines legacy reward pool and them to lengthen the constant and massive withdrawals currently being made the next terminals that are unlocked will be steadily added to the world pool right so basically we're gonna get a new game with new nfts uh, a new token which is gonna be five million total token supply but it's gonna be pegged to one dollar or it's gonna start from one dollar wait let me where did i see that shit uh okay so this will have a constant in-game value of one to one with the usd so it's pegged to a dollar down from development tokenomics right so it's gonna be only five million of them and it's gonna be one dollar what 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 did that mean that the market cap is gonna be at five million dollars all times i mean highest what i don't, I don't am i stupid i don't know how that's gonna work out if it's pegged to one dollar and there's only five million tokens uh but i guess we'll see all right so if you have fleets in it like i do as well uh then you're just gonna have tickets that are a discount so you still have to spend some money because like what's gonna be the discount 50 percent 80 percent uh who knows and so it's gonna take five days plus the two weeks which is beta testing beta and that is it so the crypto mines game that is now the legacy will still be running and i guess you can still earn the rewards that you were earning so if you were making fifty dollars a day you can still make fifty dollars a day except you just have to withdraw it immediately with the thirty percent tax and uh you know have minus fifteen dollars because otherwise everyone's goddamn selling but uh, yeah that's basically what's happening rebrand regame retoken re everything and it's gonna happen within the next two weeks or some shit like that and then we can mint for the three weeks after that and then no more minting only breeding you can you can make two spaceships fuck it out and breed a small little baby spaceship that's gonna grow up go to college go to spaceships college get a spaceship job and shit like that i guess all right well hey we, we're gonna see what happens when it happens until then you know deplete the pool play the game take out the rewards all in all i made profit on the game i guess and uh yeah i bought a bunch of shit back here when it was going down and i thought it was like well it's gonna go down to here and then uh go back up maybe but no no it got completely fucked so uh i think that's that's about it new game new token new life new me new year uh see you in the next video